people always battle tying uh, this kinky wire or uh, or the boa wire which is a titanium wire which you can see it it just bends it doesn't sorry it doesn't bend or kink it's it's very sort of flexible and it's it's lovely wire to use but the way to do it is to tie a figure of eight knot here which is two turns and I'm tying it onto the swivel first this is 50 pound wire and there you can see the basic figure of eight knot okay and then what I like to do is just put my fingers inside that loop so you see here's the swivel here so the fingers are inside the loop just those three pull it down where I can actually hold this whole loop and the sorry I've got two fingers in there now didn't realize I was doing that and then uh, there's the figure of eight there then I like to just wet it and grab some pliers get some pliers and grab the tag in quite firmly and then pull it in one one pull pull it tight in one pull just like that you don't want to now go and pull it tight again because that's when you actually mess the knot up at this point I normally cut the tag end off because it's away from the swivel and it's quite a bit easier so that's where I am now with any wire even if it's nylon coated wire it's very important now that you actually grab this knot and you slide it down to the swivel then you can get the, the wire and a nice firm grip around your, your hand like that and then just pull that up and the special thing about this wire is just watch here you'll you'll see and you'll hear the stretch watch it actually stretches the next step is to join the wire to the leader without without actually having a swivel or anything there so I'm going to take a piece about that long I'll make a loop in it I'll just get my casting glove off so I make a loop in the wire and I'm going to do an Albright but it's a fairly special Albright this I'm going to go into that loop give myself a little bit of a tag end and then I'm going to go one two three turns and then you push this up so you, you've actually taken the nylon and you've pushed it up and made a little loop put the tag end under there and then you've got to pull all of these tight almost simultaneously that's the basic this loop here I'm just gonna pull out but that's the basic shape of the knot and you'll see it taking I normally hold it in my fingers like that when I'm pulling it tight but you can see it taking shape there again wet it and because I've only got two hands I've got to use my mouth and there you'll see there's three turns of the fluorocarbon around the wire and then the tag end sticking out you cut the tag end off really close and then make sure you cut the right piece of wire sort of pull it away from the knot all right and there we've got a very neat wire trace and this is for the heavier spinning outfits we're using 50 pound wire here so it's quite a bit heavier than we'd use for snook or anything we have actually done this for cooter hoping to get a cooter on the spoon here as you can see there's no swivels it's very clean very almost finesse type fishing